Hey guys, it's Sodi here. Today I'm very excited to be trying out the new Senya. So here's how I built her. So I basically went for an attack focused build with some survivability and speed. So you don't have to go for too much survivability on Senya because she has built in crit resistance. And also you don't have to go for too much speed because her S3 will give her a counter attacking stance which basically means that she has a 100% chance to counter attack if she gets hit. So yeah, I chose to go for Elbrus Ritual Sword. I think this artifact is really good on her. I also managed to pull her own signature artifact, Spear of a New Dawn. So I'll be trying out this artifact too, be trying out both Elbrus and her own artifact. So without further ado, let's get right into Arena. So I'll be using all sorts of teams today ranging from Cleave to Bruiser. So let's attack every defense on this page starting with the one on top. So let's start off with a Bruiser team. So I'll bring a support Soul Weaver. So DN pairs really well with Senya because her buff synergizes really well with Senya's kit. And I'll bring, hmm, bring Water Crow here. Water Crow really good into Ally Crow. And I'll bring one more unit. So I could bring, hmm, could bring Landy here, but I want to see Senya's damage. I don't want to see Landy's damage. So let's bring Basar instead of the Landy. I think Basar is really good here. Okay, looks good. Let's go. Okay, so Abasar got outsped. I mean, he's got some ER, so he may resist. He did. Okay. Yeah, man, Abasar's on the ER build. So, yeah, so burn this. Okay, we missed the Ravi. That was a 50-50. Let's buff everybody here. Alright, defense buff. Uh, who do we push back though? Doesn't really matter, I think. I'll just push back the solitaire. Resisted, okay. Let's see what buff we get here. Buff immunity, that's pretty good actually. Alright, see the damage here. That's pretty good damage, I'd say. Not bad. Three point two k. That's not bad, honestly. Alright, let's go for the S two here. So we got a lot of buffs here. Is he solitaire on Valen? Should be. Yeah, um, she strips something. Okay, okay, damage is pretty good actually. Counter. 1.8k. That's not bad. Okay, here comes Ravi. Alright, so I don't S3 yet, I'm just gonna S1. Try and take out the Solitaria. I think that's an ER Solitaria because she resisted a couple buffs already. Alright, so Solitaria just exploded thanks to Senya's Blade Mail like passive. So yeah, Senya has some kind of um, uh, return damage in her passive. So if she gets hit, she's going to reflect, yeah, damage reflect. Look at that, Ella Crowd took 2.6k damage to Senya's damage reflector. Okay. So I did bring a counter to the Fire Ravi in my Water Crowd, so we should be okay here. Oh, she stunned her. <laughs> 
Let's go for the S3 here. Um, we're gonna cut the Senya yeah? so we can cleanse that stun. So we'll do an S3. Yeah. My Basas also got 100 crit. He's got ER crit. <laughs> Uh, yeah, kind of a weird build. Alright, um, not gonna take her out. I wanna see Sanya's damage on the Fire Ravi. See if you can hit. We missed. We missed, but we did 2.4k damage. That was on the miss. Wow, so she hits really hard thanks to her attacks not needing crit. Alright, next battle. So I'll go for the the last defense. So this is a very offensive crowd control defense with Arbitrary Filter as a damage dealer. So what I'll do here is I'll go for hmm, bring Water Crow again, but I'll bring a a cleanser. Um, could go DJ Basana. Nah. Let's go for design a little bit. And do I want to bring an RB counter? Nah, I don't want to bring RB counter, that's kind of cheating, so... Let's go for... Who do we go for here? Let's go for Dien again. I think Dien's pretty good. Going up, up against a lot of strips, but I think we're okay. Yeah, let's go. Okay. So we're basically playing turn two here. Effectiveness buff. I that's like the worst buff I think on Senya. Wow, that Politis did a lot of damage. AK HP Politis, basically a damage deal. Wow, are we gonna get cleaved here? I think we're gonna get cleaved. <laughs> Okay, proc gap. Wow, look at that. We got cleaved, guys. <laughs> yeah, too much damage. Um, So I defense buff, I think. I don't S3. Uh, let's go for the politics. Alright, let's see a damage coming in from the Senya. Yeah? Okay, he didn't proc gap, but I think we're gonna fall here. Miss, 2.4k, okay. Counter, okay. Proc gap and he crit. Dang, that was close though. That was really close. Okay, let's try that again, let's try that again. <laughs> okay, this time I'll sheet though. This time I'll sheet. This time I'll bring a RB counter. Alright, let's go for Blood Moon Haste. Yeah, my DN got taken out. She's on a resist build, so she's not that tanky. If she survived, uh, I think we got that. Nice counter. Wow, look at that. Triple stun. Proc gap again, two times in a row. This time our Senya got taken out. <laughs> but, but I think we still got this though. Yeah, if my Senya was tankier here, then she would have lived, or if she did not get credit. But I think we still got this though, right? Yeah. Alright, let's take out Arby. So yeah, if you're going up against a very offensive team, then you need your Senya to be tank here. Okay. Hmm. Let's go. I'm
Yeah, I think I'm gonna take out the Arbiter here with the Ammo Haste S3. Alright, next battle. <laughs> if uh, Senya did not get critted by the Gap RB dead, then she would have survived that, I think. Alright, let's go for the second defense now. Hmm. So, let me think here. So, there's an Arbitrary Filtered. Okay. I think Bazaar's too good here. Yeah. So, we'll get the first turn if I go for Bazaar. Yeah, let's go. Not bringing an Arbitrary Fildred counter, but I think we're okay here, because we're getting the first turn. Hopefully I hit the Ravi this time, missed again, wow. Missing a lot today. I mean, it's a 50-50, so... Alright, so Senya should have... Very high crit resist now. Yeah, counter attack. Okay. Applies the buff here. Effectiveness buff again. I don't like that one. <laughs> okay, I like all the other buffs though. So I'll push back the Ravi. Yeah, she can give attack buff, defense buff, immunity buff, um, effectiveness buff, and healing buff. Let's see the damage here. FCC took like 7k, that's a lot of damage. Gab again, so <laughs> Abby's just proccing Gab non-stop today. Alright, Bazaar fell. But I think we still got this. Wow, we did a lot of damage to the Abby though. Okay. Taking a lot of damage here. Okay. Alright. All our buffs are working, that's good. Let's go for the S2 here. And we got defense buff, crit resist, um barrier. Very tanky right now. Simply take out the Ravi here. Very nice, okay. Counter 1.5k, not bad. Counter again 2.7k. 2.7k, that's pretty good damage. Um not bad considering you know can't crit. Proc the S2 here, healing buff maybe. Effectiveness. <laughs> Alright. He fell due to the um, Arbiter fell due to the Blade Mail passive. The Reflect, Damage Reflect. Damage Reflect 2.3k. S1 did 2k, so that's a total of 4.3k damage. Pretty good. Okay. Okay, so he just took himself out <laughs> by attacking us. That that's interesting. Okay, all right. So we got two defenses left. So the thing about these two defenses is that they both have Rowana, and yes, Rowana is a hard counter to um, to Senya because of the, the because of her passive, basically. Yes, yeah, so. We basically have to play a fast game here, so I'm just gonna go for a cleave team. So go for a cleave team with my Senya. But Senya does decent damage, so she'll still contribute. Uh, let me think here. Looks good, I think. Yeah, let's go. You 
Okay, I see how well she does in the cleave team. Oh wait, is Politus gonna cut? Wow, so Politus also counters Senya. Wow, that's so bad, we just lost. Okay, so Politus counters Senya, guys. I need... Yeah, I needed, um, what's her name? I missed everything. Yeah, I needed T Surin there. I mean, not T-Surin, uh, TM Lulika to counter the T-Surin, but she got Episode crowned. Alright, yeah, pretty much over, I think. Let me think here, um... can't bring Senya into Ceres plus Politus. We, ju we just can't. So we can't go for a Cleave team in the third battle without Senya because the Ceres plus Politus combo basically hard counters her. So let's go for a Bruiser team instead. So let's see here. Hmm. So we need to bring a cleanser, so let's go for let's go for design a little bit again. I'd like to use DJ Bazaar, but Politis basically also counters DJ Bazaar. Wait, let me think. Now nah, we need another damage dealer. And let's bring a hard counter to the Rowana. Yeah, let's bring ammo haste. So the Rowana, hmm, the Rowana is a hard counter to our Senya, so I'm bringing a hard counter to combat her, yeah? Looks good, alright, let's go. Okay, so Senya's gonna proc a passive here, which will... Proc, Astral Guide, yeah, yeah. Poet is really good to send, yeah. Okay, let's cleanse everything here. The thing is, do I even want to S3 and give myself the counter attack stance? And hey, look at that, we just healed everybody. Go for the S3, I see a damage here. Wow, we actually took out the Tempest Siren. Okay, that's nice. Yeah, I think she did like 4.6k to the Tempest Siren. That's basically half her health, yeah, due to her passive. Okay, so right here, yeah, um, yeah, Rana counters Senya pretty well. Good thing we took out the Tempest Siren. See a damage here, no attack buff, 2.4k with our attack buff. It's not too bad. Right here, Senya proccing Elbris, yeah. Okay. Just a grind here. Alright, now we have to take out that Rowena somehow. <laughs> Idols cheer. Okay. Elbris. Oh, can't, don't tell me we can't take out the Rowena. Let's 
S3 here. I think I think we have enough damage overall. I mean, we have three damage dealers. Like MOH S3 will do damage. All right. So we did 5k overall there. Okay, Roanna. Mm. Right. See the damage here. 1.9k, not bad. Let's see, design a little bit of damage. 4k. Yeah. Design a little bit did more damage. <laughs> because she can crit, that's why. I'm not gonna bother soul burning because it's a high ER build. See the damage here. Yeah. See the S3 damage. Two point seven K. That's not bad. So you design a little bit S3 damage in, for comparison. Both bruisers. Four point seven K. So design a little bit does way more damage. I guess because yeah, my design a little bit has like three hundred crit damage or something. So I'll be trying out her signature artifact now. Spear of a New Dawn. This artifact basically amplifies the damage output of her S1. I'll also stop attacking defenses with Roana because Roana just hard counters Senya, yeah? Alright, so let's go for the first defense. So let's go for a cleave team here. So let's bring our Bazaar. Alright, Bazaar plus some hmm, damage dealers. Let's bring our Spectre. Another book holder, and let's go for TM Luluka to counter the Arbiter Field Trip. Alright, let's go. Okay, it's a speed RB, that's, that's fine. Okay, let's see the buff here. What buff are we getting? Attack buff. Oh, so okay, so it's a random buff per ally. Soul burn here. Yeah, I did not know that. I just, <laughs> I just realized that each ally gets a random buff. Not, I thought everybody gets the same buff. Okay. Hmm. Go for the S2 here. No politics, so we we're safe to go for the S2. All right. So we have the guild artifact. So. We're not gonna get MOD beat here. Okay, I think I try and stun the the Ally crowd here. Or do I try and stun the series? Let's try and stun the Ally crowd. Oh, effectiveness buff is actually really good here. We have a hundred F effectiveness now. So if that Ally crowd had ER, um, we we actually could have stunned him thanks to the. Effectiveness buff. <laughs> I see a damage here. No attack buff. Okay. Ella Crowd took 2k. Ceres took 4k. FCC took um, 4k. Not bad. Do I go for the S2 here? Yeah, it's a try and apply blind on the Ella Crowd. He's He's got his S3 here, yeah. Hopefully he misses here. He missed, that's good. Counter 1.2k. That did nothing, wow. Okay, so try and take out Cerise here. Okay. No, attack, attack the, <laughs> don't attack Bazaar, attack the Senya. Alright. Spear of a New Dawn, 3.6k, that's not bad. Okay, I see a damage here. Okay, we reflected 1.9k, S1 1.7k. Apply buff, attack buff for the um, S10e, that's really good. Okay, I guess effectiveness buff is not too bad because her S1 applies attack, I mean, um, provoke. Okay, interesting, alright. Let's 
go for the second defense. Let me think here. Hmm. Do I want to go for a cleave team again? Yeah. That design a little bit could be an issue. Let's see if she can cut. Uh, it's a... Alright, we're in trouble here. It's a DJ Nobby. I mean, I think I one-shot him still because there's no barrier. Counter. Wow. Will that proc um, send his passive? That's good. Okay, TM Lulika got defense buff. That's really good. Oh, it only lasts one turn though, the buff, so she lost it. <laughs> um, I think Arby's gonna fall here, I think, even though he's a tanky Arby. Yeah, we got Symbol of Unity, yeah. Alright, so... I stunned a little bit, right? Let me think, who do I stun? Yeah, let's stun a little bit here. Alright, see a damage? I love the animation, really nice. Not bad. Counter. Okay. 3.8k with the artifact. Artifact's not bad, but I think you better go for other other artifacts. Counter, okay. Gonna try and take out the Lilibet here because she has her S3 up. Wow, very tanky. Okay, we have to take her out here. Yeah, we took her out, we didn't need that dual attack. Okay, 2k. So the artifact basically gave me a 1.8k damage boost. Almost doubles the S1's damage. Not bad. Counter attack. Nice. Okay. Let's just take out the Ala crowd here. Alright, interesting. So the artifact does amplify her damage pretty well. Her S1 damage that is. I wish it also worked on her S3. Okay, I'll do one more battle here. Do one more battle. But I don't want to attack any of these defenses because there's a Roanna which hard counters her, right? So. Yeah. Oh, it's this guy again, the second battle. Um, <laughs> that guy again. Hmm. Yeah, we already attacked him, so I'm not gonna go for him here. Um, could go for the first defense. Very offensive defense, though. Hmm. Yeah, we. Yeah, let's go for the first defense. Okay, so. Hmm, let me think here. It's sign a little bit the way to go here. I don't think we change up anything here. I think we just go for this. Yeah. Alright, let's go. Okay. So we have to be able to tank this. Okay, here comes Politis. I think the design a little bit is gonna cut the Arbiter. No, she's not. Okay, so Senya got critted. Um, we still won, but if Senya did not get critted, I think we won there. So I'll do one more battle after this. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll do one more battle after this.
interesting. Maybe I should make her tankier. Now nah, she wouldn't have survived the Arbiter Filtered S3 there because of the defense break from the um what's her name again? Uh GG collab unit. Forgot her name. Um what was her name? Elfelt, right, yeah, Elfelt applied defense break on her, so there's no way she's surviving that. Alright, so do one more battle here. <laughs> hmm. Let's refresh. I don't want to attack any defense with Rowana. Alright, so let's go for this defense. Okay, interesting. Interesting. So. Hmm. We can bring D in here. Okay, do I wanna... Hmm. I don't think I bring Crow. Do I bring Crow? Let, let's try out a different knight. Nah, Crow's good. Defense buff for... I don't need Design a little bit though. So I'll bring another damage dealer here. Um, let's go for Landy. Looks good, let's go. Yeah, been using Bazaar all day, let's try out Landy. Okay. Tom Sanya's passive. Effectiveness on the end. Um, effectiveness buff on the end, that's completely useless. <laughs> Push up everybody here. Push back, Arbiter. Right, see a damage. Okay, so she does some damage, but like, don't. Um, don't assume that she's not do too much damage, yeah? She's not like a heavy damage dealer. She's more like a bruiser. Okay, hmm. Let's go for Arbiter. It's a counter Arby, okay? We're very tanky right now though, so we're okay. gonna miss though, yeah. Wow, look at the RNG on that, keeps proccing the S2. See the buff here. Interesting. Healing buff on Landy, but she's already full health. Um, so I'll go for the Arc Demon here. Arc Demon's got her S3 though, that's an issue. Oh, maybe I should have tried and provoked her. Counter. MODB. Okay, here comes the S3. Alright, definitely go for the attack buff here. One point two K through the blind. That's not I mean that's not too bad. <laughs> um I think I, hmm. 
I just defense buff here. I'll have to S3. Landy's turn's coming up. I can basically soul burn. Ooh. Oh, come on. It's like the chance is not high to do that. Okay, we're blinded. We're gonna miss the Arbiter because, yeah. Oh, we hit the Arbiter. We got lucky there. Okay, so we can take out one. Let's take out the Arbiter here. Attack buff. Let's take him out. Okay. So many debuffs, so many blinds coming in. Okay. Alright, take out the FCC now. We missed, but. Oh! Hmm. See the buff here. Healing buff for the Landy that's here. Did I just blow my S3? Yeah. So burn too, why not? Wow, the FCC's alive, are you serious? Finally. And he procs, keeps procking the S2 every turn. It, it, that's not supposed to happen, guys. The chance is not high, it's like 50% or something. Um. S1, wow we hit, okay, great. Alright, we got S3 again, we're blinded, but let's go for it. Attack buff, see a damage here. We hit, and he procs counter. Okay. Alright. Yeah, um, Optimus has her S3 up again because of all the counter to the passive she propped, but I think we're okay here. Maybe I shift. Nah, we're gonna take out the Arc Demon here. Alright, good game. Yeah, Arc Demon procking her passive. Basically, applying blind to my um, Senya. Basically, lowers the damage output by quite a bit. Alright, interesting. Alright, that's pretty fun, honestly. That was a pretty fun session of Arena. Oh, if you guys are wondering what, what defense I use, here's my defense team. So I've ran all sorts of defense teams in the past, you know, I've tried you know, all the meta um, defenses, I, I did Rowana plus T-Siren, I also tried Rowlet, you know, um, Ceres. Honestly, uh, when I was using my 300 speed Ceres on defense, I had like 40% defense rate almost every week, right? But right now, um, sure, Arbiter Vildra has a lot of counters, but... Um, my defense with RB has the highest defense rate, like um, I finish 30% um, every week with RB on defense. Um, if I change him to t Siren or Rylet, my defense win rate drops. So yeah, I like RB even though I'll get attacked by a lot of MO Haste or Sinful Angelicas, you know, RB counters, I'm fine with that. I can still maintain a 30% plus defense. Uh, win rate with him on defense. So yeah, final verdict for now. I think Sanya is pretty good, but not really in arena offense because of Roana. Roana hard counters her. Politis also counters her pretty well, and those two are paired together in a lot of um, defenses, right? So yeah, I don't think her signature artifacts too great on her. Um, because it doesn't amplify her S3 damage, it only amplifies her basic attack. Um, I think it's better to go for Elbrus. I think her signature artifacts better on a unit with an AoE S1. AoE basic skill like Fire Charlotte. Um, yeah, Elbrus is better. You can go for damage mitigation artifact too if you build her tankier. Like, I could lower her attack to 5k and increase her you know, HP to like 18k. Increase her defense, make her tankier. I could do that, but... For today's showcase, I want to see how much damage she does, yeah. Mine doesn't have any imprints, by the way, it's all from gear um, I've run, you know. Sure, my gear's got crit chance, crit damage uh, on them, because I don't, you know, I don't have any gear with attack percent, with high attack, but no crit chance, crit damage. My best attack percent 
gears have crit chance and crit damage. Well, the weapon and helmet. Uh, yeah, the armor pretty good. No wasted stats. Um, necklace too. Necklace is okay. It's got attack main with good speed and flat attack. The rings are really good on her though. I upgraded this today. Um, I didn't have a proper ring for her, so I had this lying around at plus nine, and I just maxed it out, and it rolled okay. Rolled pretty well, so yeah, pretty good on her. Her boots, it's my SSB boot, but yeah, pretty good. No wasted stats, just the weapon and helmet that's got wasted stats. Yeah, I went for triple attack percent main right side. So yeah, that's pretty much it for today, guys. Um, I think she's not good in arena offense due to the uh, due to Roanna plus Politis being everywhere on defense, but I think she would do better in Guild Wars and RTA. So I'll be trying out in Guild Wars and RTA next, so stay tuned for that. So yeah, that's pretty much it for today guys, hope you guys enjoyed today's arena video. If you did, please give my video a like and subscribe to the channel. And don't forget to join my Epic 7 Discord, the link is down below in the description. So have a great day guys, Sodi signing out.